How's it going? Um, yeah, so like, I went and I took a little nap um, after the the, the other stream, <clears throat> and I wanted to play more, so I launched the game and was doing the uh, the climax battles, which you'd think is something Mr. Libido would be interested in, but weirdly he doesn't show up. Um, yeah, I was doing those, and they're really hard. You have to like think you don't just like mash x and then occasionally y and also occasionally b and also occasionally a um so i figured fuck it um this just may i i, I was considering making it just like a uh an exclusive an archives exclusive but it didn't feel right doing that um it may as well be because it's fucking 3 20 in the morning but uh you know, it didn't feel right doing that for a like a a, a, a a chronological series having, but I I guess I did do it with Pizza Tower to be fair. But uh, story is a little more important, and it would be weird if I because I, I I can say with confidence that this would happen if I did like a pre-recorded version, a pre-recorded episode, and because I'm you know behind on. Uh, I'm behind on archives again. Shocker. Um, and so, like, I did another part in the fucking... I, I streamed another part that uh, that people would actually catch live before posting the pre-recorded part. That would just cause a whole lot of confusion. And even though I don't really intend to be doing any story shit, because it's, you know, late and most people have gone to bed, um, you know, I mean, eh, eh you know, eh. I just kind of wanted to play the game, and I, 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 it wasn't fair to play it off stream. It wasn't fair to you, it wasn't fair to me, it wasn't fair to God, and it certainly wasn't fair to Majima. Or Grey. Poor Grey. Um, I do have a Dr. Pepper, so here's your... It's not, like, straight up uh, uh, monster, because it would be kind of fucking stupid for me to drink a monster at 3.30 in the morning. Mm. But... Um, I can't have a, a Dr. Pepper and cream soda with zero sugar. Uh, it's tasty. It's good shit. Anyway, speaking of good shit. Yeah, the, the climax battles, I thought it was just going to be like, here's a, here's a fight from the story. No, it's actually like a separate mode. Um, and it, it locks a, a lot of shit, basically. Like, some of the ones I was playing, you couldn't use like certain modes that I had grown accustomed to. It's like, it's just too many stipulations. The combat's not as fun if, uh, if they're, you know, 
uh, uh, conditions, I suppose. Also, forgive me because it is 3.30 in the morning and I just woke up a little bit ago. Um, I may not be as as articulate as I usually am. Uh, I may be even worse off uh, reading. So I want to go see Mr. Moneybags. Oh, hey, kid. I forgot her name. It's a kid from the other day. Well, I was going to go see Mr. Moneybags, but... Uh, you back, kiddo? I told you it's dangerous to hang around here alone. Hey, sir. How about you drop the sir thing, huh? What's got you hanging around here now? Come on now, speak up when somebody asks you a question. I'm looking at the blue chestnut, the squirrel doll. What? Now it's the blue one you got your eyes on? The blue chestnut is super cute too. If you say so, you got your heart set on that now? Ah, kids. You got me one the other day and I'm happy to have it. I'm not greedy. I don't have a daddy. My mommy is at work all the time. She says there's no money for frivolous things, so I just wanted to come look at it. Well, you ought to head home soon. You don't want your mom worrying about you, do you? I know. I just want to look at it a little longer. Then I'll go home. Every second you stick around this part of town, you risk too much, kiddo. <sighs> Only way to keep her safe is to grab that blue squirrel when I get a chance. I think I already have one. Excuse me for one second. Fuck you, dupe. Uh, let's see. It may be key to you that I have it. Oh, no, here we go. Bingo bongo. No problem. And Duke has vanished. Well, I was looking forward to fighting him. Here you go, Bob. I won this a while ago. Huh? Oh, yeah, I am. Here, enjoy. It's a blue chestnut, the squirrel. Wow, it's a blue chestnut, the squirrel. Yeah, that's what I fucking said. What are you, deaf? Take care of them. Squirrels ain't my thing. Really? I can't believe it. Everyone's gonna be so jealous when I show them at school tomorrow. Jealous of that little thing? Yeah. The other kids always talk about their daddies buying them dolls, and they show them to each other. I get left out whenever that happens. But now, I'll have something to talk about. <laughs> Release the dead dad brigade. I'm glad for you, scamp, but I ain't your daddy. I wouldn't really know. But don't daddies buy things for kids? I suppose it depends. But that's a dad thing, yeah. I knew it. So if I did have a daddy, he'd be kind of like you, right? Huh? How you figure? Because you gave me two dolls. Uh, I did, but... See? And you look old enough to be a daddy. So you're just like daddy to me. How old's this kid think I am? I wish you could be my real daddy. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You know that ain't gonna happen, right? Can I just call you daddy then? Say what? Oh, uh, you don't want me to. My choices are sir or daddy, huh? I ain't too fond of either, but what's the right play here? Please just call me Majima. Gotta show respect to your elders. How about using my proper name, Majima-san? Majima-san. Yeah. That's better. Nah, I wouldn't hurt her feelings. Why is this gotta be so damn hard? <sighs> Call me whatever you want. I don't care. Really? Yay! I like daddy best then. I'm getting some mixed feelings here, kiddo. You best get back to your mom. Okay, bye, daddy. Take care on your way home. He's such a nice guy, though. Taking care of random strangers' kids. Yeah, I need the practice. Let's fight. Wow, you guys are like the three fucking stooges with how easily you are getting bonked by this bat. Whoa! 
Ow, fellas. Let me just, let me, please just let me do my spin move. It's really cool. You'll like it. You'll like it, I promise. Please just let me spin. See, watch. Check it out. Isn't that fucking sick? Yeah, you're glad you let me spin now, aren't you? Owie. <laughs> I hit them both with that. Really? Well, this is a good opportunity to uh, fill my belly and lift my spirits, as it were. I will have. Uh, hotel course. Mmm. Why not? Delicious. Denada. I mean, uh. How do you say you're welcome in Japanese? What's up, Mr. Money? Huh. Want to hear more about the investment fund? Could take a while. Yeah, that's fine. Fine. Yeah, it's money. It's money. It's it's money. It's not hard. That's pretty much. Oh, okay, good. Interesting. So the money I put goes into this real estate guy in Camarocho, huh? That's right. When a certain someone in Camarocho invests some cash, it comes here to it comes you to you here in Sonbori. Of course, we take our cut first, so it ain't the full amount. If the investment pans out, though. Sure, you sure make a killing. Radio. That about sums it up. I think I get the picture. As a sign of good faith, here's a little cash injection from the fund. That's a lot of dough. First, you gotta get your business up and running. Use that money as a kickstart. And once you're flush, invest it back with us. If you just get wasted, it won't last long, and that'll be the end. Be sure to put it towards things that'll make you more money. Then you can play around once you got extra. That's the key to getting rich. All right, can't turn that down. Yeah, it's free money. Getting back to things. Welcome to the investment fund. What'll it be today? Um, can I send weapons now? Can I mail weapons? I guess not. Just put this in the in the general fund. Just say the word. <laughs> Baked sweet potato. I do mine in a little bonfire of fresh bang notes. Gets them. It gives them a nice rich flavor. You know Welcome to the investment fund. I will take money. Best of luck in your business dealings. Thanks. Also, good old Mr. Libido. Hey, buddy. Huh? Mr. Skibbit, Skibbity, Skibbitito. So unreasonable. Now you're trying to party at the Grand? They won't let me inside. Something about a dress code? Not even I can bend that rule for you. Oh, come on. Besides, once you set foot in there, I can't deal with you as a friend anymore. Oh, yeah, this is a... Uh, guess I'll have to give up on the grand. Yeah. Got any new info about cute girls around here? Huh? Just asking for work reasons. Uh, leaving messages in Ashtaba's, Ashtaba Park's public bathroom. Lady with her mind in the toilet. My kind of girl. <laughs> the tip. Okay. Well, I have a shitload of money in my pocket now. I maybe actually shouldn't have... 
Okay, how much of this money do I need to invest in the Sunshine Club? Because as far as I can tell, it's not that much. So I'm wondering if I shouldn't invest it in Majima's power. Because he desperately needs it. I desperately need it from him. So... Hmm. We'll see. I'm gonna wander around town a little more and just pray that uh, Mr. Shakedown doesn't find me. In for a beating? I love beating! I wanna do some beating! You want to go over the edge? I want you to go over the edge. Hucha! <laughs> I hope there's like a skill that I can unlock that decreases the stagger from that, because good lord! Look at Mr. Fucking Fancy Feet here. Look at Mr. Feet. Because that takes so long. I'm happy with that, though. Rainbow Textile. Oh, yeah, shit. I gotta go look at, uh, uh... Uh, yeah, the, the fucking the shop, the dude that I that I dispatched. Not in that way, not in the yakuza way. And I wanted him to go find things for me way. Oh my god, you again? What she got her eye on this time? Uh, just a minute. Oh. Excuse me. Hey, buddy. Equipment search results. No choice but to rely on signs and gestures? Mission went reasonably well. A dagger. Receive the equipment, item, recipes, parts, or assets found by your agent. Equipment is immediately ready for use. Recipes enable you to craft equipment provided you have all the necessary parts. If the name of an item is not shown in the crafting menu, it means you have not yet discovered the parts. Dispatch agents to various locations. Okay. Once you obtain a new piece of equipment, it becomes available for purchase in the shop. Crafting it will be cheaper than buying. Excellent. Not bad for Fei Hu. Not a professional agent, but I'm going to have a couple of the agents in our network. I'm telling you, looking for more agents as well. I'll have to expand our network to get better information on powerful equipment. Okay. That's, that's got to stop. That's a fun bit, but it's got to stop for now. If you got one of a kind weapon, you ain't going to want to sell it to some agent guy. Running good now? Okay, good. Good, good, good. Agents can bring back recipes with information on how to create a replica. I can then re recreate the item in my workshop. Need parts for that. So get parts. We have some spare ones here. You can have them for free, you lucky man. Thanks. Ronald McDonald gave me a bunch of random shit to work with, too, so. This is just dead rising. Can I make a dildo launcher? Please let me make a dildo launcher. Cursed handcuffs? <laughs> the grounded chef Kajow. You bring parts, we make equipment, you bring money too. Otherwise, we no eat. I can craft or sell you more of any equipment you already obtained in the past. Getting just a recipe without ever having made the item doesn't count, though. Wait. More of any equipment you already obtained. Okay. 
Okay. Ah. Got it. Send agents off to find recipes and parts for you to make me awesome weapons and protective gear. Sounds good. Gotta start saving up so I can afford all that. Oh. Eggs. Where eggs? Oh. oh. I'm sorry. I was so busy with the equipment search that I forgot all about shopping. Again. Granddad? Grand? The Cabaret Grand? <sighs> mm. Majima Sana, it will take some time to make preparations for a more substantial equipment oh. search. Find something to do and come back later. Good luck with the prep. Wait, really? I... So, I, I can't craft? I wanted to craft. No, 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 I will teach you new ways to wield them. Yeah. That really gonna be necessary? Ain't gonna be a- Ain't gotta be a genius to work out which way's the pointy end. Yeah. Consider it part of my service. It'd be a shame for you- It would be a shame to leave the full power of weapons you obtained from me untapped. Assuming that pigeon Japanese- What the fuck is that? Uh -huh. Pigeon Japanese? I, I don't know that one. Got my own way of doing things, but hey, if you will go through the trouble, I'll hear you out. I'd also recommend that you work at honing your bat skills. There's a wealth of hidden potential there. Mm. Think so? Kind of figured bat meets head was pretty much the extent of it. God, he's so based. Yeah. You have much more to learn. But by my estimation, your bat technique could prove even more deadly than... Could prove more deadly than even swordplay if you develop it. Yep. More deadly than a sword? You serious? So this. Quite. The bat and katana are alike in length. They say some baseball players purchase a katana and practice their swings with them to heighten their focus. Considered as a, another class of weapon, the bat's weight resting at the tip yields exceptional destructive power, making it distinctly different from a blade. Broken English. The type spoken by Asian immigrants back in the day. Really? Well, these are, uh, 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 like Chinatown, like they're Chinese residents, I believe. So, I, I, I believe that's why there was the language barrier. <laughs> <sighs> they're obviously two different things. Well, and also there was the, uh, uh, the foreigner in, in Kiryu's mission with the pizza and the biza. So, the principle's not so far off, yeah. right? I'm telling you, there are techniques you could perform with a bat that simply wouldn't be possible using other weapons. I suggest you work on uncovering these. <laughs> well, yeah, I need money. Making a big deal out of this, but a bat's a bat if you ask me. You just whack people with them. God, I love Majima. Truly a groundbreaking technique. I'll teach you new weapon skills as you progress, but I ask that you show me your bat fighting skills in return. Okay, well, you're gonna train me in Slugger, which is fine, because I want to be, uh, I want to be trained in Slugger. Show you anything you want, but I ain't exactly the professor type. Yeah. I got an idea! Yeah. What is that? When you teach me new weapon moves, how about you take me on with that weapon? I'll fight back with a bat. Mm. It'd be difficult for you to pick up new techniques that way, I fear. I believe it is better to begin by learning the proper stance and forms. What, you gonna make a pro baller start by playing catch? We ain't exactly amateurs here. I'd rather get a feel for a weapon naturally, in a fight. Japanese is a hell of a lot harder to speak than Mandarin. I I would not know. That's, that's beyond me, unfortunately. Suppose that method may be better suited to you. <laughs> Been looking forward to going another round with you anyway. <laughs> this should be fun. <laughs> Perhaps that is your true motive. I'll be here when you are ready to continue your training. Yes, I would love training in the art of, uh, smashing fucking faces. But first... No, none of the above. I guess I have to talk to her? For, uh... Okay. Remove mark when you check a new destination, okay. What you need. I'd like you to make something for me. You can make wood? Butterfly knife! That's fucking sick. Super spicy knife. Stun gun. Sunburst. Iron hammer? Collapsible steel staff. Fucking shotguns? I have to have a slime gun to make a shotgun? Huh. Brat, yeah, okay, I'm gonna have to fucking, I'm gonna have to make those. Modified lighter? 
That's fucking awesome. Unorthodox. Cannon. Wooden tonfa. That. Spiked Tycho sticks. Modified model gun. Okay, 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 okay. So. I need to make that for, uh, uh, fucking, uh, you know, man, uh, box man, a manga magazine. Thick enough to provide some protection. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Mail? Like, armor mail? Avarice shirt would be nice. Fireproof shirt. Eh. Jet black jacket. I'm pretty sure that's what I have equipped. Mule shoes. Bunch of shit. Bunch of shit. Okay. Alright, let's do some uh, dispatching. Holy Jesus. Let's fucking send them to Africa. Ball buster? A double action revolver? Long sword? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I really want the fucking long sword from a lucky find. Getting thick magazines under your clothes is a very common way of making improvised body armor. Well shit, what do you know? Okay, um... We'll slide him like five extra mil. Or, uh, sorry, four extra mil. Okay, um... I can buy brass knuckles. I didn't even know I ever had brass knuckles. Okay, well... Uh. Can save Ryuji's Audio dad according to the that. canon. <clears throat> well, I imagine a little book would struggle against a canon. Let's see those plus twos in the chat! Okay, um, should I get training? You wonder? You reckon? I feel like I should. Alright. Um, sticks. Sticks are funny. You wish to learn the Kali sticks. We'll train in actual combat as you suggest, Majima Are you healthy and ready to fight? I'm ready. Ah. Yeah, I'm good. Let us go outside. Fuck his dad. Don't gotta tell me twice. Alright, bub. All these sticks consist of two short sticks. They're usually made from wood called rattan. Have you heard the word Kali before, Majima-san? Uh -huh. Nope. Maybe, uh... In the... No, this was... Wait. This is before Temple of Doom, so that joke wouldn't work. Never mind. Hi. Kali is actually the name of a martial art in the Philippines. It is their national sport. The word Kali comes from the local language. The weapon spread throughout the United States, and the word sticks was added. I'll leave out the details, but their practicality has made them popular around the world. A weapon from the Philippines, huh? Who would have thought? But you really think they're world famous? <laughs> Reuser hero. It's nice to have, like... It's nice to have people to look up to, you know? It's easy for simple weapons such as these to take root. Just... Only thing I've seen that uses two sticks are taiko drums. <laughs> Do not underestimate their potential to cause harm. Ah. Let's get this show on the road. Look forward to getting another look at your bat techniques. Okay. Should avoid using our more powerful moves. Here I come. So will I be able to switch weapons?
Owie! I thought you said we were gonna not do, like, super cool flippy moves, ninja shit. Owie, 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 owie. Jesus Christ, brother! You got moves, man! God, I can't believe that doesn't have any, like, sustainable armor. Well, I guess you won that exchange. How with? Knock it off. I'm still pretty untrained in the art of the bat. I'm just trying to fucking... I'm just trying to, like... Go easy on me, man. Oh, God. Clonk! I keep thinking I have a bigger arena than I have. Fuck it, I'm just gonna keep spamming this move. Screw you, guy. Excuse me! Your animation was done. Yeah, we are bleeding a lot. It's a turn-based RPG now. You got fucking crazy speed, though. I respect it. I'm just gonna keep doing this, because I don't have many other slugger moves, so we're gonna stick with this one. I can't believe that doesn't have armor. I keep thinking that it does. I don't need a significant health boost. I don't really need a dramatic health boost. I just need enough. Whatever. Fuck you, guy! Yeah, let me just clonk my bat up against a whole lot of nothing. What even? How dare you? I feel bad for the slugger style. Like, it deserves better than fucking clonking in the walls. Also, I lo I'm loving this fucking, like, uh, old kung fu movie bullshit. Yeah, how do you like them apples? How, how dare you? I'm gonna keep fucking poking you. Poke. Poke. No. Poke. 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 Straight bullshit, though. Exactly. Exactly. <sighs> Sticks lose! Well fought, Majimasan. Let us return to the store. For some food. Hi. Ended up being overpowered. Yeah, because I learned where the block button was. Not the right way to use those things? I believe they are best used to press the attack rather than defend. If you land enough blows, you can even stun opponents, making them ideal against swift foes. So can I use other weapons in the slugger style? Ah. 
Thank you for visiting Dragon and Tiger. Can I... You don't have to page me. I'm in the fucking store. Tending my broken ribs while simultaneously cooking sticky ribs. <laughs> it's called Dragon and Tiger. It is. It is indeed. I'm gonna have some creep, and then so wait. Am I capable of switching, or is it just the bat? Only available to masters of the bat and dagger. Okay, so I can switch. I think. I well, maybe not. I I actually don't know. It may be just unlocking more moves. Where was Mastery 1 anyway? Is it this? Also usable with other battle styles? I don't know what that means! Whatever you say, man. Just pluck the heart string. Surely there's some sort of symbolism there. Yes, hello. I would like uh, the two kinds of creep, please. <laughs> okay, well, I have the ability to, uh, I have the ability to, um, uh, uh, learn dagger moves, and I want to do that, so I'm going to do that. Were you the dragon and tiger the tiger? Right, no, I know that. I'm just saying, like, surely there's, like, some folklore symbolism there. Hi. Interference from the locals. Did you get a gun? Mission went better than hoped. Excellent. He did obtain a gun. Beautiful. Come again soon. Yes, I would actually like to send out a guy right now, as a matter of fact. Um, North America? Send him to the fucking New York Mafia. Yeah, do that. Wait. That's it? Honestly, I think I would... A launcher? I think I might rather have that. TV host. Rock musician, negotiator, spy, ex-marine. Yes, sir. Here's a couple extra dollars to, uh, make your day. We'll make it... Hang on. Yeah, you know what? Actually, fuck it. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, we're done here. Uh-huh. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to switch weapons or if it's like different moves that come with the other whatevers. Um, I very much want to see Majima use this. All right, bud. Teach me. Oh, never mind. You don't teach me daggers. What? Uh, Yeah, I guess poles then. Healthy and ready to fight. I am. Uh. Single action navy. I know that's what I'm saying. He. I mean, he's got the fucking outlaw eye patch, so he he would look well like a uh uh uh, uh well an outlaw. Uh -huh. Doing some real traditional shit now. Yeah. I'm from Taiwan myself. Many techniques originating in China can be found there. Reach differs from a bat as does the speed of spinning attacks. Uh. Let's see it in action then. Look forward to getting another look at your bat techniques. We should avoid using our powerful moves. I don't know what the fuck. What does that mean? Uh, 
a jab, that's it? That was sick. Wow, nice jab. You sure got me. Okay, fine. You've made your point. Not, not cool. We should avoid using our powerful moves. Bat, meat, head. He's got cool moves, though. I don't understand. What the fuck is the point of that move? It just puts me in more fucking lag than it would be if I just stood there and blocked. Like, I can act out of the block. I can't act out of the fucking jab. It looks funny. That's about it. that I can't even get at least a little bit of movement while I'm blocking. Like, just to be able to reposition myself into a more favorable area. Because I can't use any heavy attacks to break his guard here. At least this is a good excuse to get some crab. Got us a bunch of bullshit, though. You beat his ass with a f drop four Mizno. You got it, dicks. Actually, I picked it up from a homeless guy. Or, no, maybe he gave it to me. I Suck it, ancient martial arts, my man. I love keeping uh, I... funny dialogue for mine. Tried to slip my attacks past your defenses, but the sheer force of your strikes overwhelmed me. Yeah, sure, that's what that was. Thought you'd take off. Not too shabby on defense either, huh? Pull allows you to protect your lower body as well. Try using it when up against multiple foes or opponent that targets oh. your legs. Okay. Well, I mean, he doesn't charge me, so fuck it. Let's do another. Oh, wait, no. I gotta go. Hang on. Let me go get some creep. One sec, one sec, one sec. I don't really understand the context of the moves that I'm learning. Maybe, maybe I should go pick a fight. I'll go pick a fight and see if I can't, like, switch the weapons or whatever. Yes, give me Kreeb. Thank you. Mmm, Kreeb. Delicious. Delicious, delectable Kreeb. Yeah, the fucking thing's done. Whatever. Let's go pick a fight real quick and, uh... Let's go quick pick a fight. Because I'm not allowed to use the moves that I'm learning from him on him. Alright. What's up, bitch boy? Uh, mastery 2... Oh, does this just mean I use the weapons better? That's fucking irritating. I was hoping I could, like... Oh. Whatever. Fine. Watch this. Hooah! Oof! Oh, 
He's so fucking cool. Ow. How fucking embarrassing must it be to get your ass absolutely destroyed by a guy who's just fucking dancing? This might be my favorite style. I really like it. Like, the single target damage leaves a little to be desired. But not even really. It's just so visually distracting that I, I have a hard time learning what combos are what. But God, it's so cool. A lightweight aluminum bat manufactured by Mizuno Perfect. Purchased at your local dicks. Well, it was free to me. Hey, kiddo. Which one is it now? Ah! Daddy! You scared me. <laughs> really got an eye for these dolls, don't you? It's just... The pink punchon looks really pretty. Pretty or not, didn't I tell you how dangerous this area can get? You're not looking for trouble, are you? No, I'm sorry. <sighs> Here we go again. Pink bunch on, huh? I'll see if I can get her one. Okay, let's see if I have better luck this time than I did last time. What the fuck is a, a bunch on? Is it the bird? That's really funny. All right. Bado. Stato! No, I saw it tipping, damn it! Imagine her ass is just watching me play this. No, nope, that's not gonna work. Unless? Well, shit, I thought it would have rolled off. Hey, I'm happy to be wrong. I wonder if I shouldn't just grind out the claw machine now so I don't have to do it later. <laughs> nah. Here you go, kiddo. Still staring at that Bunchan doll? I am. Here you go, a bouncy little Bunchan. A real pink Bunchan. Thank you so much. Say, how come you like dolls so much? I'm just all alone when I'm home. Having my squirrels around feels like I have friends over. That's why dolls are the best. <laughs> yeah, that's nice. And now Bunchan gets to join the family. Thanks for everything, Daddy. I'm gonna take such good care of him. Yeah, yeah. Now off you go. Back to your mom. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Maybe now the tea party's complete, no reason for her to hang around here anymore, I hope. Ah, uh, well, we got one more thing, so maybe. Like, I wanna... Hmm, I'll at least go fucking get my... The Dead Dad Brigade is here. I'll at least go get my fucking shit. Hi. Dude, he's an ex-marine. There's no way he, he took that shit. Okay, good. Destroy... Destroy... Destroyer of Lands, Majimaguru, and the Destroyer of Lands. Oh, his ass fucking raided Area 51. Are you kidding me? You come again soon. Yes, I do. Like, right now. I mean, the black market, but Knuckles. 
long haul fisherman, professional wrestler, con artist, samba dancer, traveling, tra traveling cellist? Excuse me. Excuse me again. I guess, yeah, we'll send the traveling cellist. With a couple milli. you make ball buster you can really send people flying anything new destroy there we go destroyer of lands has the firepower to send foes flying sturdy nunchaku steel mail Okay. All right. Oh, I've already sent out the guy. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Ain't specifically sentimental. I know how it is. I have a gun. Do you know someone that owns a gun? Am I, am, am I healthy and ready to fight? I mean, I'm ready to fight. Am I healthy? I'm reasonably healthy. Fucking nunchaku. What the fuck are you talking about? What? I'm ready. Uh. What are you saying? Made a family guy joke. Oh, yeah, okay. I should have been able to pick up on Ollie. He's like my favorite character. Huh? Ain't a soul alive who don't recognize those. Pretty easy to look like a badass swinging those around. Oh, I'm also a fan of the Nunchaku. I work on crafting new variations every day. Pretty ballsy to try and improve the classic. Hey. I've been reading a historical novel, and I'm attempting to combine a weapon that appears in it with the Nunchaku. Perhaps you will encounter it in due time. Is it the fish? Guess I can always beat the details out of you. Look forward to getting another look at your bat techniques. Okay. Chinese Santa joke? Oh. Darn. I'm gonna clank! God damn that clank. Oh, I was I don't know what I thought was gonna happen. Was he just sliding towards me? I'll take the clank. That was a decent amount of damage. I'll take the clank. Like, there's no wall there. That shouldn't be a clank. Whatever. 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 The dude is kind of invincible. I've been kicking the shit out of him and he's been, uh, he's been recharging pretty fast. That one went better, I think. That one, that one went pretty well. 
<laughs> Beating me, Majima-san. Let's go back to the store. Yes, lads. I would like to learn dagger techniques, please. Also, you're not charging me for this, so this is fine with me. The jock who got nothing on me. Hi. Legendary Asian stoicism? I mean, the dude has a fucking scar across, like, the biggest eye scar I've ever fucking seen. At least my full full fury, but she still defeated me handily. Any parting advice from the Nunchaku Master? Nunchaku can slip past the enemy's defense. Try not to, or try try not to or try to hook them. Damn it. Deliver powerful oh. finishing moves. Uh-huh. I'm not really gonna put any of this to good use because eh, but I mean, whatever. I'm just gonna go get some crab, I'll be right back. None of Majima's fighting styles, I think, so far. Uh, Breaker's pretty good. Like, it, a lot. I like all of them, but none of them are as, like, fucking strike me at the heart as well as Beast does. All right. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> Blessed by Hobo Steve. I mean... I have come a long way with one bat. With one bat. Normal bats break. This one must be like special. Also, Yoda wants me to go visit another club. I guess I, I'll do that after I wrap this up. Hi. All right. What you got for me? Less than welcoming. He's a fucking cellist. No shit. Treasure! Woo! What treasure? A double action revolver! God damn! I got a Chivo for that. Alright. To the fucking to to Europe. Sicilian Union. Golf club. Hammer. Ooh, hammer. Umbrella. Mm. I'm thinking hammer. Adventurer, negotiator, secret syndicate, orchestra conductor, self-proclaimed angel. Uh... Warning sign? Okay, I have to send out somebody with a high chance of bringing me home a warning sign. Have two extra million. If it ain't 45 long, I don't want it. Well, you're not gonna get it. Majima's gonna use it. Majima's got bitches to shoot. Majima's got enemies. It's a little, little baby. Little bitch baby. Yes, hello. Katana! Teach me the ways. Ah. Ivor Johnson. Katana's been a weapon of choice warriors among the in Japan. Ah. Wow, that was... Awful reading. History 101. Sharpness not found anywhere else due to the complex forging techniques involved. They are the ultimate bladed weapon. I tried forging them myself, but it is not easy. You'd forge katana too? Yeah. I've not mastered the technique to the point where I could sell my creations. Right now, a friend crafts them for me, but I hope to someday reach that level. Does that mean if I slip this time, I'm going to be losing appendages? This is getting real. Yeah. No, that would be unwise. I will use a wooden katana. <sighs> I was looking for- I was kind of looking forward to it. Oh. It is for the best. However, you should know, I shall be using an unusual form. What, you gonna go all drunken master on me? What's the deal? <laughs> You'll have to wait and see. <laughs> Fei Hu, master of suspense. Guess seeing will be believing. <laughs> I look forward to getting another look at your bat techniques. Uh-huh. I think the agreed upon 
uh, census for, hang on, for Katana is, uh, you know, what it, cut, it can cut through most shit, but whatever it can't cut through will snap it in half. Form looks really conventional conventional to me, boss. Like I was in less end lag having clanked. On. Uh, face him. How are you heated up but are using the same moves? Oh, I don't like that. My computer froze. I'm just gonna keep mashing Y and praying. This is a problem. Uh, the game broke again. D did it have to happen during a fight? Okay, um... Fuck. Well, in that case... I'm just gonna have to fucking hold block and hope it's in the right direction. Or sit here and wait for Streamlabs to unfuck. I wonder... Wait, hang on. What if I do this? Okay, that did not unfuck. Uh oh. Huh. I, what what code in this game is completely destroying my fucking streamlabs? Like what? I don't understand why. It, whatever, it doesn't matter. I should stop striving to understand, for I will never understand, is, uh, is what I'm understanding. <laughs> okay, well, uh, I guess since, um, Streamlabs decides it wants to be, uh, broke, we're just gonna, I'm just gonna fucking hold block and pray! I can't see anything, by the way. I'm having to go entirely off of audio cues. Blind swordsman shit. Uh, fuck, I broke my string. My string? Brother, I have to tell you, it's... No, 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 no! Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Pause, 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 pause. Streamlabs unfucked. There's a significant, uh, significantly lower delay on Streamlabs than on, like, actually having to watch it through the stream and use audio cues. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. This is actually playable. Oh. 
Yeah, brother, you're good. Your style looks pretty conventional. I don't know what to tell you. Jarat. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to save and reload the game anyway, because, you know, I I'm staring at a fucking black screen here. If I'm using a real sword, I'd be in ribbons. Can you walk? Let us return to the store. Yeah, uh huh, uh huh. <sighs> Be real dead, try to focus more on your next attempt. What the fuck do you mean? I was focusing and then you like you decided to cast some sort of fucking voodoo magic to make my my screen disappear and I lost like half of my health to that shit. Fuck you. Anyway, I'm gonna go have some crab. I'm gonna have my fourth crab lunch for the day. Shiroyama ain't got shit on a fucking ex Yakuza with a baseball bat. What's up, nerd? Do you want some cream? Do you have some oleo? Uh, I'll take the... my Hime crab nab. Okay. I must relaunch the game, for the game is borked. I'll beat his ass next time, just you watch. Yeah, unsaved data- no shit unsaved data will be lost. That's why I saved, dummy. Stupid motherfucker, bitch ass. So, barring the uh, pirate game, is Majima actually playable? This is more of a rhetorical question because I don't think anybody that could answer it is here. But, um, is Majima playable in any other Yakuza game? Because I know there are like several different protagonists. Um, obviously, there's Ichiban. I think you play as Nishiki in one of them. Um, and then there's like two or three characters whose names I don't remember. Uh, actually, it may just be the two. There's like this old, disheveled, drunken looking guy. I, weirdly, I don't know what's been doing it. Because I don't think I've been making that many, like, searches around it. But there's there's been a lot more Yakuza content showing up on my Twitter feed. So it's probably just good old Musky Wusky, like, spying on me. In which case, I hope he likes what he sees. Uh. Honestly, I wouldn't even accept sugar daddy status from Elon Musk. Because then I'd have to look at his dick, and I don't think I want to see that. I don't think anybody wants to see that. Hi. Can't read maps! Got lost on the way home, dumbass! Well, he didn't find any treasure, but he did find a fucking warning sign. That's what I was looking for. Alright, I'm gonna give that a break, because I don't think I need any more equipment right now. Oh my god. It even has do not swing at people inscribed. Yeah, I gotta use that. I gotta go pick a fight with somebody and fucking use that. Alright, let's try the, the cats in that again. Yes, I'm healthy. Uh, yes, I'm ready to fight. I'm always fucking ready to fight. You kidding me? I would hate for my bungholio to get polio. Yes, you don't have to give me a fucking history of the katana. Let me just beat your ass. Hey. Yeah. <sighs> <laughs> your fucking your tactic is to get behind me. I know. I get it. I can read. It, it's come on. I'm not brainless here, man. My name's Majima. Yeah. <laughs> 
I, you know, I'll take that clink. I don't, I don't mind. That, I, th I feel like that was a worthy trade. Wow, you took that one like a champ. Damn. I don't know why I did that. It worked though, because he's stupid. Nice whiff punish, dork. Like I said, Fehu, I don't really lose twice. Although I think I was talking about Kiryu when, uh, when that was a subject of conversation. Hey, you wanna go fishing after this? I think you're supposed to use B for guard break, but the the nunchuck swing is a way better guard break. Because it doesn't put you in four fucking years of end lag. Like, watch! Even that's quicker! I know I'm using fighting game terms for not really a, like a... A PvP fighting game, but shit. I don't know what else to call it. Like a, a, a an end animation, I guess? <laughs> I won! Now all I can think is the fucking CDI link. I won! Hi. My sword style is a difficult one to read, but you anticipated my every move. You... You... Using the same three. It was not that hard. Uh. Sword looked real sweet too, maybe I'll give him a shot. Katana tends to be an expensive weapon, you should save it for when the time seems right. Cost a million yen easy. I'll pick one up and give it a whirl when I've got cash to blow. Okay. Next. Oh, wait. Hang on. Let me go get some crab. Once I get this mastery done... Honestly, I don't know why I'm so committed to this. It's like... I'm kind of disappointed that I don't get to use other weapons in the in the slugger style. And ultimately, it probably doesn't matter, because once I unlock his legendary style, I don't think I'm going to be using anything else. I'm just really hoping that the legendary style is like... Like it speaks to me as much as Beast does. Cause like I I can't use Rush at all. I suck ass with Rush. I don't think I quite get how it works. Um to be fair, I haven't upgraded it like at all. Um Brawler I can deal with, but Beast is just the way to go. Like smashing fucking bikes over people's heads is just it's so it's it's the right thing to do. All right, Tonfa. Yes, I would like to learn Tonfa. Ah. Let us go outside. Yes, let us. Ooh, I'm kind of hungry. I think I have some chicken nuggets left over. <laughs> the Tonfa is a weapon from Okinawa. A set of two is generally used, but I prefer to wield a single Tonfa. Uh -huh. You got a reason for that? You're a rebel? Yeah. It's more portable this way. In some countries, they even use them as police batons. There's plenty of room to adapt them to different styles. Let's see. You're going to show me these styles, huh? Of all the weapons I teach you, this is the easiest to wield and most suited uh, to one, one, to, yeah, whatever. Skip the chat and hit the sticks then. <laughs> look forward to getting another look at your bat techniques. Uh-huh. It's the same techniques that you've been seeing, brother. Oh, whoa, guard break. This may actually be kind of fun.
Let's refrain from using our most powerful moves. Sure. Fucking rare up swing. Ooh. I'm glad. I'm glad I didn't let him hit me with that. Whoa! It's not even that good for an interrupting tool because you can't dodge out of it. You can't, like, reposition. I don't understand what it's for. Lock on button. That'd make it a lot easier. Lock on. That's not game. Gamepad, sorry. Uh, right bumper. Really? Oh, what do you know? I have played through this whole game without using the lock-on, and now I feel stupid, because it's the same fucking button as Devil May Cry. No! <laughs> Ow. There's no way! There's no way that's a knockdown! I don't want to have to use my healing items, but I really don't want to fight this again, so I will if I have to. Never mind. Everything turned out okay. I'll just go eat some crab and we'll call it even. Bat beat stick! Excellent performance. Bat beat stick. In rock, paper, scissors, bat stick, stick pretty much always loses. Plan to bash my way through your defenses, but you staved off my attacks admirably. Defense was pretty ironclad yourself. Well, um, eh. Makes blocking intuitive. You can defend at any time, maintaining your stance. It offers a good balance of offense and defense. Range is limited. Uh-huh. Okay. So there we go. I've learned all your moves. Now what? I believe I have shown you all the techniques I know. So we're done here? Been most rewarding seeing your bat technique in action. It's nothing special. You remind me of the weapons still have much potential to unlock. Hope you continue to visit the dragon and tiger from time to time. Uh, I'll be seeing you. Uh, 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 a meal? Yeah. This is a restaurant after all. Perhaps you'd forgotten. What? So, yo. My husband care about weapon only. He should think about cooking sometime. <coughs> man, don't crash the man's passion. <laughs> don't bust his chops too hard, Longbois. Gotta say that I'm glad this place turned out to be more, more respectable than I thought. Mm -hmm. What you mean? You deal in weapons, right? Most of the time that means the back room is hot with criminal activity shit, but here the only thing getting hot is the Kung Pao chicken. Yeah. It's more of a curio shop, you could say. We don't sell arms to anyone looking to cause trouble. My only interest is in studying the virtues of fine weaponry, kind of based. Uh. I can appreciate that. If you ever get into trouble, you know who to call. Ghostbusters. That's gracious of you. Wow, original joke. <laughs> Topical, too. You be good boy now, Majima-san. Because, you know, Halloween. Okay. Bye bye. Wait, can I collaborate with you? You don't say nothing. If they who? Training anyone else in weapons? Never seen anyone else around here. Have in the past, one of my former students now travels the world with my agent seeking out various equipment. Uh huh. Twin brothers also involved in the weapons business. Okay. Come back to Stone Boy on occasion. I'll introduce you if the time works out. Two more guys as crazy about weapons as you, huh? That ought to be interesting. Okay. So is it just small talk from here on out? Okay. Okay. 
I'm still not 100 percent sure how I'm how I collaborate with uh, local businesses to uh, uh, put the word out for my club. I mean, I maxed out my friendship with the fucking sushi guy just specifically for that. I would like the crab nab. Oh my. Oh my. Maybe I do it from the menu. I thought I checked that, but. Uh, oh no, I didn't check it. That's right. No, now I remember. Well, that was weird, and I don't think that really improved my slugger game, like, at all. Honestly, it may have been a better spending of my time to go talk to the fucking breakdancers. Where's Sunshine again? Okay, way the fuck over here. So I gotta get to the club. <laughs> oh shit! Wait, I turned too soon. Oh. Can I unlock infinite running yet? I got kind of spoiled playing as Kiryu. Ah, well, I'm getting there. Close enough. Plus, as Mr. Money Socks, I very well, I very much must uh, run as much as I can. Oh, you want to fucking fight? All right, goon. Not wrong one. Let's see what you got. Nice sword, Iwasaki. You earn this. Wait, really? That's it? That's it? Are you fucking... Okay, fine. You ready to say you're sorry? He was bleeding out. Honestly, it would have been funnier if I just left him. He's out of our league. Yes, I fucking shot you. It's a miracle you survived. I'm disappointed in the warning sign. Hello, Yoda. Let's go check out Club Mars, actually, real quick. Go check out Hino. <laughs> let's get going. Yes, let's. Let's fucking swipe some of his girls while we're at it, because we need more. <laughs> this is Hino's Club Mars. Mars backwards is SRAM, which is one letter off of SCAM, so, you know. <clears throat> See you soon, I hope, Tabata-san. We should get outfits like that. I like those better than what we got. Make it back as soon as I can, Aichan. <laughs> Wonderful, I'll be waiting for you. Uh? I did that deadbeat a favor and sent Ai to his table, but he didn't spin Jack. Uh? I forgot the voice I gave for him. Hino-san, who the hell does he think he is, treating Ai like that? She's the number one girl of Club Mars. I, I don't want you dealing with cheapskates like that louse anymore. Like that louse anymore, got it? <laughs> but Tabata-san is a long-time regular. He mentioned his finances were tight this month. Cry me a river. If you don't got the cash now, he's useless. Businesses don't run on kindness to poor parasites. <laughs> I want you serving the fat cats because you know what makes the world go round? Money! Money, money, and more money. Oi! Listen up, maggot. 
We need a higher end liquor at the club. Let's pimp out the interior. Use gold leaf or something. Yes, sir. What's with this Hino guy? He's got another thing coming if he's that fixated on cash. Also, we're standing right there. How does he not see us? Hi. You know, thinks money can solve anything, including how to run Club Mars as a business. So he spends as much as he thinks he needs to get more customers in and become a popular club. He's actually spent a small fortune to attract girls from other clubs. That's why the quality of his talent really sets the bar. The girl who's undisputed number one at Club Mars is I, who's been working there for a long time. She's the number one at Club Mars, eh? Did he know drag her along in a gold... Her in along a gold-paved road, too? Yeah. Shit. Seems to be the lone exception. Apparently, she simply wanted to work at a cabaret club and just applied. The girl who walks in off the street winds up making more money than the girls he spent tons of money to recruit. The irony of it all. Par for the course. Can't expect girls who betray their clubs for cold hard cash to provide excellent customer service. That girl, she seems so nice. She's cute, too. <sighs> I wish a girl like that would come and work for us. Yuki and the others are a bit plain. What? Hey, watch it. You see that kind of stuff in front of Yuki and you're dead meat. Mm -hmm. What's going on there? Oh. Do you know them, sir? Yeah. No, just two buzzing flies who need to be swatted. Here's another job for you. Go exterminate them. Yes, sir. Let's go, I. Okay. Um, are we having an issue with bugs in the club? Eh? This is bad. Let's get out of here. The man who spends all his money on fools is more is the is all the more a fool. <clears throat> what are we gonna do, Majima-san? I'm gonna take care of him. You make yourself scarce, Yoda Chan. Sheesh! Make a Jontron noise? Oh, I missed. How do you like them apples? They're sign flavored. <sighs> that was rough, was it? Majibusan, are you okay? Uh. Yeah, I'll live. Hino from Club Mars, one of the five stars. He ain't gonna be easy to get rid of. Okay, well, let's go fuck him up. Let's run the club. We should probably give Yuki the day off, but she makes us money. Anybody call out? No call out. Okay. I just want to figure the fuck out how to... Oh, he is in the wrong district. So where am I? Moon area. No? Wait. Am I in the moon area? I'm kind of stupid. No, I'll be in the Mars area. So, Hara, Salon Rose, Cabaret, Ron Ron, Salon Salaryman. Okay. Um... Okay. Well then, before we open up, um, we're just I, we're gonna go. Ha we have to go watch porno for a side quest, which I find really amusing. So let's go fucking watch porno, I guess.
See if I unlocked any new ones. Excuse me! I don't have time for you. I'm going to watch porn. What are they going to do? Follow me in? Watch me masturbate? Which video do I want to watch? I don't know which one of these. I think that one's new. Is that one new? Oh, that's Crossword Girl. Okay. Soft demand. Soft on demand. Me too. <laughs> this music makes me want to go back to sleep. I need energy, damn it. That did was make me sleepy. What the fuck? Oh, no. I see you here a lot, sir. You must love watching our videos. <laughs> Wouldn't go as far to say I love them, but yeah, I've been coming here fairly regularly. I'm meaning to ask you something. Have you seen any videos recently that you thought were super hot outside of our shop? I don't really watch videos anywhere else. Oh, I see. Why oh, so disappointed? I watch all of the videos we carry here. I have to, as part of my job. I became so used to watching erotic videos that my little guy stopped responding to them. Sorry, what? The erotic videos no longer arouse me. And it's not only videos, nothing at all excites me anymore. That's just being depressed. I'm scared that it'll become a problem for me in my private life as well. Too much of a good thing, huh? Even if I hooked up with a girl now, what if I couldn't get it up? I shudder to think of it. Well, I can see how that'd be a problem. Yeah, I mean, yeah. My only hope lies in finding is my whole only hope lies in finding a super hot video that can awaken my senses. That's why I asked me for recommendations. Well, you may ask. There's a dude who fucking wanders around Sotenbori in his underwear. You may ask him. Yeah. They call him Mr. Libido. <sighs> Sorry, I couldn't be of service. Yeah. Don't worry about it. I'm sorry for pouring out my troubles to you like this. Don't be so down. I'll try. Please come again. We'll be waiting. Okay, so I have to find him a super erotic video. Just so I can, uh, collaborate with him. Uh, oh, hey! Well, shit, what's up? You, I was just thinking about you. Not in the way you might hope. But, uh, you, you did in fact cross my mind. Found any gorgeous babes lately? <laughs> The girls are fun enough, but I almost look forward to comparing notes like this just as much. Let's go, Mr. Libido! <laughs> Me too. I'm itching to tell you about my latest conquests, brother. Uh. Wait, what's with this brother thing? It ain't like we're Yakuza here. Oh, come on. It's not like we're strangers. We're comrades in the pursuit of the one-gun salute. Let's keep it friendly. <laughs> now, maybe not too friendly. Mm. Let's get caught up on the latest hot girl gossip. I had to go straight to onto the other place after that. Like you weren't gonna go anyway. Did I? Did you go to that place I told you about? The service there was nothing special. Why the recommendation? You know the guy on their staff with the weird hair? Guy? Oh uh, yeah, I remember him with the weird accent. He was a riot. Yeah, he always answers the phone with yellow, but nobody understands him, so he has to keep repeating himself. 
<laughs> I was busted gut hitting him practically screaming yellow, yellow all the time. <laughs> I feel a strange kinship with you, Mr. Libido. What a couple of a-holes. Haven't laughed like that in years. Now we're having more fun talking about a dude than hot girls. I guess we've kind of drained that well dry. Can't be many girls left in Soton Boy that we don't know yet. True. Mm. Guess I'll head home. What? You ain't heading to another place? That's new. Well, everyone's got to rest at some point. Well, take it easy then. Bye. Why so sad, Mr. Libido? Okay, so now I have to figure out what the fuck his deal is, too. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So, uh... Okay. Clerk tells you to find a vid. No, fuck. What? Fuck off. Uh. Clerk tells you to find a woman dressed in white holding a videotape. Okay, so I have to. I think I have to visit again. Oh no! Woe is me! I have to visit the porno shop again. <laughs> Whatever will I do? Starter ass music. I invented the shit getter because I had a problem. I wasn't getting enough shit. Growing up, I was sort of a loser in school, and I got a lot of shit. Mm. But as I turned into an adult, people stopped really caring about me. So I didn't get enough shit. So that's why I invented this dumbass hat that you can wear called the shit getter. Buy one now. Is that a spoon? Also, I, I'm I'm sorry, but I, I don't think I could masturbate anywhere but home. I don't think it's happening. I'm definitely not going into a building with like eight cells with the other seven full of people also masturbating. I just think that would be weird. <laughs> this come again, we'll be waiting. I haven't seen that Mr. Libido guy around lately. Brother! Huh? huh? Fuck you, fuck your cheap viewers. Jesus Christ. Get out of here. God. What's the matter, stomach pains? I can't... I can't get it up! Huh? Need a hand? Yeah. No, 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 I can get it up. I can get up just fine, I can't get it up. You... Really? Mm. Since I last saw you, I've been cutting back on the parlors and clubs and stuff. Then before I knew it, my mojo was just gone. <sighs> well, that's what kept you going. Ain't no shock your strength's failing you when you go without your three meals a day. Y yeah, I shouldn't have held back. I need to go see some girls. You ain't going nowhere like that. Head to the hospital and see a doctor instead. Please, brother. Go to the drugstore and give me some of the good stuff. Good stuff? Mm. Yeah, it's an energy supplement called the Incomparable Habu Drink. One of those should get me back to normal. Energy drink? You were taking that stuff all along? That explains a lot, actually. <clears throat> you ain't planning on propping yourself up with one of those and going off to a parlor, are you? Push it too far, and not getting it up will be the least of your worries. Could even kill you. Some things are worth putting it all on the line for. That's... I'll be fine. Please, bring me the drink! Oh. 
No use trying to convince you when your mind's made up. If you know what you want, I'll help. Thanks, brother. That Koku drugstore on Sotenbori Street's the closest. Better get him his drink quick. Um. Um. This one? Oh, Jesus! This one? No. Uh, I may be stupid. It... Temple. Where the fuck did he say it was? I was not paying attention. Shocker. Um, well, the brain is off. So, uh... That's not the closest drugstore, Majima. That is not the fucking... Okay, fine. <laughs> Enough shakedown. I'm here to shake down the shakers down. Bonk! Nope! Yeah, power up! Power up for the ass beating! Uh oh. Owie! Home run! Why can't I. Wait, why can't I go to the fucking. Batting Cages Majima? That'd be fun. Let's go help Mr. Libido get his groove back. Porno! Card. Where is it's not on this side of the street? Ah, Mana Sakura. You know, I'm just gonna say fuck it and put some of this money into uh, into my other styles. Phantom turn. Hold while on the ground. Jumping flourish. Heat retention. Disruption immunity? That'd be kind of sick. A lot of fucking health boosts. Damn. Evade an attack. Fling a weapon. Ooh. Ooh. ooh, ooh. Okay, let's check Brawler. Or, uh, Brawler. Thug. Rising kick. Combo boost. That'd be sick. Although that's kind of pricey. Reverse Shin Strike. I feel like Brawler might be the way to go. And grab insight. Oh, okay, yeah. Let's do this. 
It's like most of my money, but whatever. I have the money sock, so I'm going to be making passive money anyway. You want me to test out my new moves on you, scrubs? Whatever you say. Hello? It's for you! Owie. Oh shit, I missed the fucking heat action prompt. Shit, to buff. Fuck. Yeah, I can do better. I just have to learn how to fight as Majima. <laughs> Move, old man. Get the fuck out of my way. I am here for a sex supplement. We do, actually. I have to warn you, it's very strong, and that's why we keep it in the back. There's only one customer who buys it. I think I know him. You'd like to buy it, too? How wonderful it must be to be so young. Be careful with it. As I said, it's pretty strong. I'm a little scared now. Whatever, I'll take it. Thank you, sir. 30,000 yen, please. Well, I have to come through for my man walking erection. What else do you sell? While I'm here, what else do you sell? Hangovers. Die Hard Max. Nothing really... Yeah, I'll buy another one for me. Fuck it. At a thousand yen per step, I'll recoup in no time. I'll Fuck it, I'll recoup on the way back. Gentlemen? I would like more money to spend on my breaker style. What'd you just say about Canada? Ooh. The way 
way I see it, Majima styles is a their his fighting styles are a lot like his music for his fighting styles. Like they're all pretty good, but like none of them are are stick out. Well, no, that's not true. Some of them stick out. The music at least. But it's very similar with Kitty, where like I don't dislike the music for his other styles. It's just none are as good as Crash Addiction, you know? Crash Addiction is the best one. Beast is the best style and uh, for me. I also now need to go eat food. So we'll take the long way around. Or, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just drink this drink. What do we do? That's the wrong drink. Okay. It'd be funny if it made you run faster. <laughs> Fellas, this is just immature at this point. <laughs> Ha -ha! You ever seen somebody hit two balls with one swing? My rush combo! Okay, he's got quick kicks on that. I should, uh, you know, lab that a little more. Whoa. Mr. Libido, I'm coming! Don't die on me! Wait a minute. I didn't realize it was just the fucking same as, uh, like, looking for properties for Kiryu. Ki- ki Hey! She don't want to have fun with you. You're ugly. And another thing, you're ugly. I wanted to pick up the trash can, damn it. Give me the fucking okay, keg. Keg works. You missed me, bitch! Man, 
it sucks to be your lungs. An old stun gun. Why didn't you use that? Why did you not use that? Oh, what the? Oh, this is the massage parlor. Here you go, bro. I bought you the stuff. Your lifesaver, brother. Hurry up and drink it. I, I, I'm back! My energy's at 120%! I'll be damned. Guess it really works, huh? Thanks! You saved me! But I still don't quite feel myself yet. What? Like I said, I got this way because I wasn't vigilant. The beast is untamed, and it's gotta be shown who's boss. If I don't break the drought, it'll only be a matter of time before I wilt again. I've gotta pop it off. I get beat rare in a go and all, but you gotta know when to listen to your body. Maybe a little break is in order. Who are you to talk? Just how many videos have you watched in those booths since you got hooked? Guilty as charged. I get the feeling I've checked off this whole city. I pretty, pretty much know every working girl on some boy. And you guys would love to have your problem. Just go see them. <laughs> I plan to, of course. Just thinking about it is making me firm up. <sighs> Just get out of here. Go polish your pole somewhere else. Ah. Roger that. Thanks so much, brother. You should give that drink a try, too. It'll change your love life. He knows what he wants, he's willing to lay it all on the line to get it. In some weird way, he's his own kind of manly. I'll be working with ladies 24-7 has gotten me to the point where I don't even feel the urge. I gotta be start being more honest with myself about my desires. What do you know? I actually learned something from the guy. <laughs> yes, I want to spoil your fun, because your fun is at the expense of other people and that is wrong! You're fighting this guy and he's dancing at you and then suddenly like you all step back so he can't hit you and he whips out a fucking baseball bat and just starts doming your friends. Majima is the ultimate Chad. I'm losing my edge, I'm sleepy. Alright, I think I think that's a pretty good stopping place. Saving Beetlejuice from getting harassed in the middle of the street. Female Beetlejuice. And I forgot this was the uh, the phone booth where the guy wants the 9 mil, so I'll give him the 9 mil next time. Uh, I'll probably just end up fusing these both together um, into one long stream. I don't like to do that, but I think it would be weird if I posted two two-hour streams as opposed to one four-hour, like, total. And I did, I did a shorter starting soon kind of with the idea that that was going to be how this was going to pan out. So that'll probably be how this pans out. Uh, anyway... Ugh. I hope you enjoyed. I know most of you will probably be watching this in the archive. Um, so thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for being here. I appreciate you. I will see you again when I see you again. Uh, take care. Uh, yeah, just have a cozy, I guess, day now because it's 520 in the morning. So have a cozy whenever the fuck. Have a cozy whenever the fuck. Good night.
And now, folks, it's time to say good night. We sincerely appreciate your patronage and hope we've succeeded in bringing you an enjoyable evening of entertainment. Please drive home carefully and come back again soon. Good night.